MTD CNC today are in Letchworth. I'm at Maztec Precision Engineering with Wayne Boucher, who's the owner of this company. Uh, Wayne, got a new toy behind us here. When did this land? Uh, this arrived two weeks ago, Paul. Um, as you can see, they're just here now commissioning it, and hopefully within a couple of weeks we'll be away and have it running. Now, I've seen one of these machines, fortunately enough, at Mazak's uh, Europe's headquarters in Worcester. Now, this is some machine, isn't it? Tell us about the model. So, we've got a Variaxis i500 machine, which is a single table five axis machine. This is basically that machine, but on steroids. It's got 32 pallets of uh, unmanned running. We've got 145 tools at our disposal and we've got the same working envelope as the Variaxis i500. So it's a total Mazak solution, isn't it? It's their product, uh, the, the machine, the loading system, everything here, one integrated cell, should we call it. Is the idea here for you so that you can uh, not only automate, but essentially run through the night, run through the weekend? Well, that is the idea. I'm, uh, first of all, I'm trying to get rid of my life back and uh, stop working here every weekend. But the main thing really is we haven't had any capacity for a little while and trying to open up some doors to some new customers and to um, service some existing customers and to be able to just take on more work and keep our lead times down. A big investment for you as a company. Uh, you're a young guy, you've just moved into this new facility here. Uh, no concerns over work because you're busy at the moment. But still, it's... Uh, big noose around your neck you believe it's going to be a, a, a good choice I do yeah I mean this is a very hungry mouth to feed it's this eats through work like you wouldn't believe because obviously it can run all weekend uh, every time you're in bed or sleeping this is still going you know if you can keep it fed it will never ever stop and it is given us an, a lot of extra capacity but um, I believe that with the customers that we've got and the reputation that we've got we can fulfill it how important it was, was it to you to get this from Mazak as opposed to buying maybe a machine tool and then a, uh, an automation solution, putting the two together yourself? Is this a far better way of doing it in your opinion? I believe so. This is a fully integrated automation system which you, you can't beat. The machine has got intelligence built in. It knows what the pallet system is doing. It knows what the tool system is doing at any one time. It knows where the robot is. There's no miscommunication and a bolt-on automation system is okay but you can't beat an integrated system. Uh, you're one of the first to have one of these as well aren't you? I mean the machine's not been around for long. There's a few in the country I know but you, you are one of certainly the first fourth or fifth uh, businesses to install one of these machines. I believe this is the fourth machine in the UK and I think we're the third customer after you take the one in the uh, Worcester showroom. Uh, the controls on these machines as well you like the smooth, you get on with it, you've had it already on your other machines. Yeah, it's absolutely brilliant and it's so much more powerful um, than the Nexus 2 and it's so user friendly, it's got the touch screen, great big screen, so yeah, it's very good. And in simple terms as well, Wayne, here's your uh, work changer here. So this is where you're spending most of your time loading the parts. You're not having to open the door because that's, that's where the spindle is turning all the time. That's the aim, isn't it? That's it. So there's no dead time at all. So even when you're loading tools, there's um, an ATC door at the back and there, there's a loading bay at the front. So you can be changing over, taking out your machine parts, loading in fresh material, taking out used tools, loading in new tools, all while the machine is still cutting metal. Uh, these guys have been here or, uh, for a couple of weeks to get this installation going. Has everything gone smoothly? It's gone very smoothly and, and considering this is a new machine to the market, I was expecting teething problems and we haven't had any. I'm very impressed. Well Wayne, I look forward to coming back when the machine's in action because I believe you've only got another week or so, you've got uh, some training happening and then you're going to be cutting metal in anger. Yep, exactly. And uh, I can't wait to see the first time that we can get it running through the night. Uh, showing real progression here at Maztec Engineering. What a machine. Uh, this is the i300 AWC from Yamazaki Mazak.